Hi students, welcome to class 4 mathematics. Today we are going to start the first lesson, building with bricks. Our topic for today is shapes and spatial understanding, 2D and 3D shapes. Please observe these. Are you familiar with these pictures? What do you call these pictures? Yes, you are right. Shapes. Spelling S H A P E S. Shapes. All of you have learned different shapes in lower classes. Now closely observe each and every shape. You find that there are different types of shapes. Different types of shapes. There are mainly two types of shapes. First one, two dimensional shapes. Or in short, you can say 2D shapes. Second one is three-dimensional shapes or 3D shapes. First, we will learn 2D shapes. 2D shapes are shapes which can be drawn on a plane surface. That means you can simply draw it on a paper using a pencil. Shapes that you already know like circle, rectangle, oval, triangle, square, etc. are 2D shapes. Let me show you some things that you see every day. Bus, all have seen this. Pencil boxes. Rubik's cube that you play with. A house. A lunch box. A school bag. A bucket. A table, a gas cylinder. Have you seen this? It is used in kitchen for cooking. Now observe each picture closely. You can see that all its sides are not visible or seen. If I tell you to draw it, you can draw only its side view, front view or top view. If you observe the picture as well, you can't see all the sides of the object. That means it's clear that you can't draw these pictures with all its parts in a single drawing. Such shapes that you can't draw completely on a paper are called 3D shapes. Now we will conclude what are 3D shapes. 3D shapes are those shapes which have height or thickness. It cannot be perfectly drawn on a plain surface or a paper. Some 3D shapes used in mathematics that you will learn later are as follows. Now it's question time. Answer the following. First question. Which among the following are 2D shapes? Second question. Which of the following are 3D shapes? Now an interesting assignment for you. 
Group the following figures into two columns. Here are two activities for you. Number one, using a color paper, draw, cut and stick any three 2D shapes in your activity book. Number two, make a 3D shape with an empty matchbox. Thank you. See you again.